Hey guys, Quest the Vape doing some more juice reviews today. Getting through a bunch of them. I got a bunch of yummy juices that I have to review. And the next one up is Pinup Girls. Pinup Vapors. They're out of St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, I met these two gentlemen at the uh, Niagara Falls ECC. And, well, I'll just get into it. I believe they have five or six flavors. I have three of them right now that they gave me as samples that I'm going to review. I have brought these around to the different shops. Every shop I brought them to loved them. People raved about them. Um, they're delicious. The first one is, and their theme is, uh, classic pinup girls that we all love throughout the ages and, um, and bought as posters. So those are the, the classic. Um, anyway, here is Marilyn. I know you can't see it very well. These are test samplers they were given out. Um, their actual bottles have really cool artwork and, um, and each bottle has its own particular art for the, that particular pinup girl. So this is Marilyn. This is high VG, 95% VG, I believe. And it's nice and thick and viscous for dripping. Perfect for dripping. This is a, Marilyn is obviously a blonde and uh, that is a butterscotch custard. It's delicious. Mm. Nice, nice flavor. Rich flavor. Nice dense clouds, and the flavor is very dense too. Mm. I'm just, I've been enjoying this. Um, you know, it's not that they're frugal. They had several thousand people that came through, and they brought free samples for, uh, they had testers set up with hexomes. Um, just a really classy, set up and they gave out samples to everybody that came by the booth so they gave out thousands of dollars of free juice i'm not a shop i just do review videos and rants and other vlog stuff and then uh, but i also i do build workshops and i hang out at all the vape shops i am a friend to all the vaping community so i did bring these around and as i mentioned the shops love them um you guys and, and we've been seeing a lot of buzz on uh facebook about pinup girls, so I'm not the first one coming along saying, "Hey, these are great. You should try them. Um, get them." I believe they have retail and wholesale. They have a website you can pick up all the whole juice line. Um, if the other juice flavors are as good as these, I'm going to say, "Go for it. Get the whole line. Um, you can't go wrong." Mm, that's Marilyn. The next one I have is Betty. Um, this is a blueberry. Uh, I'm not going to, you know, I, I pulled them up on Facebook and I was reading the flavor qualities, but uh, yeah, I don't want to go off, uh, I don't know, can I do this? Yeah. Maybe it's still recording. Okay, so Betty is the sweetest gal on the block, which with notes of many different fruits and changing flavors that varies depending on device build device and build, she is sure to be popular with everyone. Uh, so that's Betty, uh, mostly blueberry, but with, yeah, with some other nice subtle hints of other fruits, which is refreshing and, and, and delicious. Uh, I was really, really enjoying this juice. Um, I've been very conservative with it, meagerly vaping on it. I wanted to vape the whole bottle, but, uh, but I, I am also letting other people share in the delightful juices. The good ones. Again, really good for dripping, high VG, perfect for sub-ohming. Uh, I'm not shy about wattage that I put into uh, my devices. This is the LE80 and I'm cranked up around four volts on, uh, in series here. Delicious. And I am vaping that on a set of Chasing Coils Clappings. Always got to take a moment to plug those guys. Yeah, it's the kazoo. It's the turbo. I know, I know. And the last one I have here is Lana. Lana. But again, the artwork that's on the actual bottles is much better. It's This is just a sticker that's in the samples. Lana is a 
variety of fruits. Uh, mm, let me pull this up. Exotic fruits, I believe, is the way they phrased it. Lana is a wild and crazy girl. She comes in at 95% VG and will fill any room with cloud vapor. She has a perfect mix of sweet and sour along with tropical flavors. That's what it is, tropical flavors. So you've got your pineapple, you've got your, um, you know, whatever, guava, mango, peach. It's, I think there might even be a little cherry in here. Bold. It's a bold tropical punch. And I like it. And it's not a cloth drop cherry. If there's cherry in here, it might not be. It might be raspberry or something. Who knows what my, my nose picks up. No, it definitely is cherry. So it's tropical, it's fruity, it's refreshing, it's bold, it's sweet, it's tangy with sour and a nice balance. If you like fruit punch, this is a num nums. Now I gotta re-wick and get to the next juice.